Hey, I'm Jeff Hansen with Delmar Sales here. We're going to do a quick product demonstration on a couple items that we do inventory. A uh, couple chem inductors. The first one we've got up top here is a DU1830 with a two inch manifold, cam lock either side. Down below here, we have the same unit with a chem blade internally and a three inch manifold, cam lock side to side. So we're going to get into the guts internally on the chem blade as well. Um, we're going to explain the difference between the two inch options here. Okay, so we're back over here to the 1830 system. Really, the design structure is the same in terms of the manifold uh, cam lock on either side. The only difference is going to be the manual rinse system. You have a manual rinse for the jug itself and, and the container. So how to operate that is you're going to open this valve here. That's going to allow generally water. It's going to come down and percolate down the sides of the tank so you have less residual. When you are going to rinse a jug, Jug's going to be up top, jab this into the bottom, depress this valve here. That allows water to flow inside the jug. You can rinse it out and dump it back into the hopper body itself. Once you let go of this valve, water is going to continue to percolate down the sides until you close the valve here. Okay, so now we're back to the three inch chem blade version. Again, overall structure is basically the same with the manifold system banjo manifold, banjo valves, ace roller mold tank. The main difference is going to be that rinse system. So when we get to the chem blade version, how you operate that rinse is you're going to open this valve here. So now we'll get an inside and we'll look at the difference in terms of the rinse application for the chem blade option. So this is going to be your carrier line coming from that rinse valve that I just opened. It is running to this rotating nozzle here. So as this nozzle rotates, it sprays around the edge of the tank, gets all the way up in the crevices, percolates down we found that this option works very, very well. Okay, so now we're going to talk about the chem blade itself. We do advise extreme caution when you're using this. It's very, very sharp. It can be used with jugs or granular bags. There's a venturi, which is, which is a suction system on the manifold of this tank. It pulls out granular product just the same as it would a liquid. So what chem blade has found through their testing, uh, operators are actually able to spray up to 25 to 40 acres more per day using this makes it that much more efficient. So that's your product demonstration of a couple of chem inductors that we manufacture in Omaha, Nebraska. Again, the first one would be the DU1830 with the two inch manifold cam lock either side, manual rinse. Section, second option here is gonna be a 30 gallon inductor with the chem blade internally and a three inch manifold. We do also inventory these items in 60 gallon options and 85 gallon options. So give us a call today or check out dollmeyer.com and get yours.